Well, I'm in a good mood right now. Definitely. Uh, let's see. It's, I don't know, what, 2 o'clock in the morning? I heard a noise. Uh, you know, there's a big gust of wind. I heard a noise. Uh, I thought it was the power cord maybe slapping against the back of the trailer or, or the, you know, the back of the truck and didn't think nothing of it. Um, it was probably like a 40 or 50 mile an hour gust. It hit the back of the truck real good. You know, like, you know, you felt it. I, I guess I was going over, I don't know, I was going over a bridge. I don't know if I was the New Hampshire main bridge or whatnot. Um, and didn't think nothing of it. Now I'm here on, a, what is this, 684 in New York. And I stop at the rest area, I get out, you know, I check things over. Um, just looking at the truck and I go to get in I stop I back up and I looked and the roof extender that you know I bumped into and when I made that video the whole roof extender is gone yeah it's totally ripped off uh, the fiberglass and all that's left is the mount so that whole top of that roof extender that sticks out is gone uh, yeah so I'm Slightly irritated. So, hey, anybody that knows uh, any salvage yard that has uh, a T680 Next Gen sitting in it, um, you know, let me know because, yeah, I could uh, use a roof extender. Um, yeah, I'm really irritated right now on myself. And, uh, and uh, yeah, but, hey, I guess shit happens. Uh, I don't know how much it's going to affect my fuel mileage, but uh, I guess I... You know, I was going to get up there anyway when I got home with a ladder and take a look around. But I guess I better really get up there now and look, because uh, for all I know, there might be holes in my roof. Uh, I don't, I don't know. Um, maybe it ripped the uh, the mounts right out of the fiberglass up there on the roof. Uh, so now something that probably would have turned into, you know, a couple hours of me, um, you know, with some probably some epoxy or um, JB Weld and. You know, maybe some uh, ABS plastic panels and paint or something. I don't know. Probably wouldn't even have to paint it. Uh, now it turned into me having to replace the roof extender. So, yep. Um, probably to buy a new one since it's brand spec and new truck. I'm going to say, even without it, you know, I'm not, I would just paint it black. I'm not too worried about it. Uh, probably looking at about $3,000 for that plastic piece. I I'm just taking a shot, you know, considering the truck's like a $2,000, $200,000 truck. So, yeah. Uh, don't, don't do nothing stupid. <laughs> um, you know, I know everyone's going to come on here and say shit happens, you know, everyone's done it. Uh, jumped the fifth wheel, backed into it. And it doesn't help that, the, you know, the trailers, you know, I had the, the fifth wheel slid up so far for aerodynamics. Um, I don't know. It just seemed like a normal day getting under a normal trailer and you know, uh, if you look at my short, you'll you'll see what happened. So it's it's no no fault of myself. Um, I guess no no worth. It's not worth crying over sour or spilt milk or whatever. So I just figured I didn't there. Like I said, um, I always wanted to stay truthful. And you know, this is this is the stupid shit that happens in trucking. Everybody has stupid days where it, it, just dumb things happen, and it and it, it, it eats at you, especially when you're an owner operator. You know, let alone let alone a company driver. So, uh, yeah. So, you know, uh, stay safe out there. You know, if you, if you break down and you can't, your truck isn't running, and you don't have an APU, just immediately, immediately call nine one one because it's not you, you'll you know these temperatures and stuff. It's it's not worth it. Uh, so, uh, please like subscribe. Uh, I'm about ready to become monetized. Maybe, maybe eventually my monetization or monetization or you know, however you want to say it uh, will pay for a new uh, roof extender for me. But uh, yeah, I don't know. This is probably feed trolls. Um, I know I would probably la you know if I if I came upon this video I'd be like what a fucking idiot. Uh, but yeah, so all right, take care everyone. See ya.